Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank Up Your Arsenal. I think today might be, might mark the final or next to final episode, and look what I got! Oh my god, it slows down the game. Did I get all of them? Yeah, I got the plasma coil. I kind of want to put them, I need to put them on my quick select. But yeah, I actually did go to Aquados, I think it's called, and uh, go see... Slim Cognito, because I actually did want those weapons from him. Unfortunately, pardon me. Unfortunately, it still does that glitchy thing where it uh, completely um, destroys the uh, camera. Like, you can't see anything. Uh, we're going to go shield charger here, and then bouncer here, and then... <gasps> I can't replace the Quacko Ray! Mm, just for now. Just for now. For now. I want to get these weapons experience. I know they... Can they level up? Pretty sure they level up. Anyway, time to go. We've got to go take down Dr. Nefarious's last, um, bio obliterator at the command center. Or at least fight our way to it. So I'm figuring, I don't know if it's going to be separate episode, same episode. We'll find out. Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Sued. Now get sued. Let's see. Got all those? Okay. Now, oh yeah. So someone told me you can literally just swing. Like, leap of faith. Don't even have to switch to it. Let's test that out. Oh my god, it's true. I knew I used to do that as a kid. I just forgot it as an adult. It's been so many years. And I tried to do it on Going Commando a long time ago. And then, like, it was either Going Commando or Ratchet and Clank regular when I tried it and it didn't work. And then I just gave up. Okay, this is that's actually a really tough spot. Because those guys are tough and... That's actually like a terrible spot for that. There's probably a better way to like assess that situation there. Like that is How about we try this guy? I don't even think that'll make it all the way to him. Nope. Okay, it it does. Dang, I was afraid that would Good lord, the da Good lord, the dablage! How am I supposed to get over there to them? Safely? I'm gonna get got a couple of times. I mean, look at, look at like, where they are compared to me. I'm, I'm literally dropping right down into them. And I, I got nothing here. How about shield charge? And then a couple of regular shields. Oh my god, it's... Wow, that does not last long. Good god. Okay. That is a tough spot. Why? They really put those guys in a tough spot. I got an idea. How about something like this? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god, stop. Whoa. Bro, that's not even the right one across the bridge. Yes! Sometimes you just gotta snipe. The Gadgetron Splitter Rifle is the galaxy's most powerful stealth weapon. It uses quantum wave phasing to fire shots through multiple enemies. Love the descriptions. Love it. Now I'm glad that I don't have to switch to the weapon. Oh, oh boy. Now that I, I'm glad that I know now I don't have to switch back to the other stuff. Keep staggering him. Hey, it is gaining experience. Yes. Ah! Cover fire? Mrs. Chicken. Er, Mrs. Tweety. It's the chickens. They're revolting. These guys are learning. I don't like it. And they deal so much dabblage. Like, seriously. Oh, God. Seriously? Yeah, I'm just trying to go... Stop! I hate this. 
Oh god. I don't always want to have to result to the Glove of Doom minions, but jeez, man. Oh my gosh. How did they design this level where the angle of all the enemies is just the worst absolute possible space? How did they do it? How did they do it? How? Oh man, this is gonna suck. I bet there's people that do this so easily. I know there are. I probably didn't even need that many. Do I need to... Yeah, I, I do. <laughs> I was going to try to boost across it, but that is an unwise maneuver. If ever I heard one. Uh, this guy. Okay. I th it's almost like playing this planet, you just have to, like, know where the enemies are from attempting it multiple times. God, it's so hard to turn this thing accurately with the... Oh, man! No! There we go. Got it. I gotta remember, I only need to press it once. It's so hard to move this thing accurately with the um, analog stick. It's really... You can go over very easily. Oh gosh. I knew it. Um, best way to deal with them is these guys. I love the fact that they have the missiles, but sometimes it would actually be super helpful if they would actually go on foot and go get the guys manually. I think they're doing it now. I hope they got him. No, of course they didn't. Come on, take him down. These guys take a lot of hits now. I'm not going to worry about those bolts. Okay, uh, let's get a couple more going. Before we ascend? No, I guess not. I know... Yeah, I knew they were going to pop up. But no way they weren't going to pop up. Let's see if we can't get a couple of these going. And then one of these. Nice. Only got one shot left. Better make it count. I bet you more are going to pop up. What the... I jumped! I pressed X. Ratchet, you're going to need the terror guys to up ahead. Security is airtight, so it won't be easy. These robot tyranoids are smarter than they used to be. Bro, I, I freaking almost walked right into that. And what in the world is going on? Okay, that was one of my little guys. Uh, gotta do my gadget, gadget thing. I probably don't have to select that either, but you never know. Where, where the heck is it? Tear guys. Nope, that's the warpath. Tear guys. Okay. Got to go talk to this guy, play the minigame. It's going to be tougher, though. It's going to be a lot more difficult. Okay. Fire drill. Evacuate. Elevator immediately. Then proceed to the nearest swimming pool and throw yourself in. I'm assuming that's what he said before. Hmm, how do I know I can trust you? Because I'm a door-to-door -door salesman. Your mother was nine-toed snaggle beast. Oh god, is it gonna make me? Oh no, it's gonna make me start all over again. I might have to fast forward this. Huh? Um, did you hear one of the, th like, did you see what one of the Tyranoids said? It said, uh, would one Tyranoid lie to one to another? Only if his lips were moving. So they called the lyrics to that song, uh, like 20 years before it ever came out. I know you lie, your lips are moving. <laughs> oh, I didn't read that last one, you'll have to pause it. I'm on a time, oh god, I'm on a time crunch. Wait, what the, what if I want to do that one? Can I hop down there? Oh, it's a platinum bowl. Of course I can. Titanium bowl. Right, titanium, not platinum. Okay. 
and then that releases, and then this goes up. I'm still in the... Oh, should I still be in the hollow, guys? Because there's breakable crates here. Don't you just, uh... Don't you have enemies just... Okay, okay, yeah, I gotta get out of the hollow, guys. Gotta go up the ladder. I was about to say, don't you have me in the hollow, guys, and then enemies just pop out from out of nowhere. That'd be a real... Real move. Real move. Ah, hollow guys again. Up, oh, <laughs> you didn't hear that. Why would, oh god, I gotta, I gotta do the thing. Hollow guys. Hey, good buddy. I hate talking to you people. <laughs> oh god, I do love mini games though. At least the first couple of times. Excuse me, sir. Lawrence doesn't like the color of his force field. He says it clashes with his trousers and he wants to deactivate it immediately. Ha! Ah. Nice try, Squishy. You know I heard a rumor about a Lombax creeping around here disguised it as, as a Tyranoid. Oof! Oh. oh, come on, I had that one. No! This is harder than it looks. But it's also very easy, and I should have passed it by now. Whoo! Please let that be the last one for this section. No! No! Come on! Oh, God, no! <laughs> Kill me! Oh, man. It, it is very forgiving. It is very forgiving, though. Bro, right as I said, it's forgiving. I can't even read. I didn't read any of that text. I was way too, like, Don't get up. Don't get up. Couldn't, couldn't read the text. Back to Ratchet. Woo, sweet Jiminy. You can't just do me like that. Elevator go up. Elevator go up. Elevator go up. <laughs> Elevator no go up. <laughs> Wasn't that from Tiny Toons? <laughs> Elevator go up. Elevator go down. <laughs> I'm going to see if I can find that now. God, I'm almost dead again. Is there no checkpoint anywhere? Please? Please, let me put up a shield, please. Let me put up a shield so I can snipe these guys in safety. Oh, never mind. I don't have any sniper ammo. Jesus, why do you hate me? Dude, I barely even have anything that can reach the... All right, back to the sniping. There's a... Oh. There's a point where they're... Oh. Dag, you nabbit, that is satisfying. You can get really good with this freaking thing. Oh my gosh. Are they literally just not going to come around the corner all the way? Okay, one of them did. Right, this one has that ammo. Honestly, if I don't have to do the um, tear guy section again, it's really doable. Especially with the PDA and all the bolts I'm getting. Okay, I can still jump. Jump. There we go. No! You can't. You cannot. Let me just wave to him. Yes, okay. Doable. Doable. 
Developers, thank you. Oh my god. That would have been really bad. That actually would have stopped a lot of people from continuing this. That actually would have stopped everybody. I, I don't think I would have done it. Whoa! Fair enough. Fair enough. Gotta be tier, guys. Gotta be Tyranoid Ratchet. What? Nothing to see here, folks. Just a happy, bouncy baby boy. Bro, I was pre-firing. I've been watching too much Call of Duty. They've been alerted to my presence. Shoot. No sadness. Okay. Uh, get some shields out there. Oh, God. Whoop. Wrong one. I'm trying to flick it. the stick. There we go. Sniper rifle. Bro, you need this flux rifle for this. Oh my gosh. Check me out, Mike. I'm sniping. <laughs> for real. This planet is one of the toughest I have ever been on. Okay, now, according to what they said, I can just leap of faith this. Wait, no, no. That's... What? That, that's... That's... There's no swing shot, so I don't think I, I, I should. Okay, I can't, I can't let, I can't, uh, I can't give these guys any quarter. I need to get inside that room. I really need to get inside that room. There we go. Okay, I just wanted this room as extra cover. This isn't so bad. I really could use a checkpoint, though. Like, now would be a great time. Let's try the Rift Inducer. I haven't done that in a while. Hold up. I sent sniper rifle time. Okay, this is where I make my stand. Dang, you know that flick is good. You know that is the good flick. Get him, boys. And this guy. I don't want to take any hits unless I have to. We good? We good? Watch it. Watch the ammo count. That gate opens, something's gonna come out. Huh? Huh? No? Oh, okay. A trespasser. At least we're getting an absolute butt-ton of bolts. Dude, I can hear him on the other side of there. Oh, look! No! Oh, dang it. I probably could have gotten that trophy if I hadn't broken that crate. I can almost get up there, too. Yup. Ah. Oh. Well, that's what I get for my hubris. You're supposed to use this little one. Wow, that's a cool scene. Check that out. Don't you wish I could just switch to the sniper rifle and blow it up from here? <laughs> Speaking of uh, all things, uh, let's go. I want my PDA. Where's my PDA? Gadgets. Let's find out how much this stuff costs. That ah, wasn't so bad. What was that, a thousand? Okay, I hope this is... Oh boy. Oh god, I haven't done one of these in a while. Time to enjoy our fast-forward mechanic again. I 
can't let any of them get through. Got my eye on you. Uh oh. Uh oh. I want to clear the playing field real quick. Yes. First try, baby! Watch it. Okay, uh... Now let's get a few more bouncer shots in there. No! Oh, man! Lucky hit. There we go, now I got him. Um, is that all of them? Nope. Okay, I think that's all of them. Yes. Let's see if I can get up there. I was probably supposed to get up there anyway. I'm just checking, like, now I'm concerned with all these crates. It's like, oh, if I break the crates, am I getting to a special area I'm not supposed to be able to access? Magna boots? Ah, magna boots. Interesting. Okay, well, this is obviously a refractor puzzle, which usually isn't really a puzzle at all. Somebody in the comment section, let me know if I've got. Well, oh yeah, that's right, this isn't alive. Um, do not get hit by that. Um, what am I doing? I haven't even done the refractor part yet. Do I have to do that part? I mean, maybe I could do this first. Gadgets, refractor, uh, where is it? D come on, Russ, you just had it. There we go. Okay. Point this at that. Now it's split off into two here. Now we see the reason for the, um, for the, um, uh, what do you call it? Magna rails. Oh, no! There we go. Gotta get up here. Might want to try that from the bottom. There we go. And then, swoopty. Okay, I think that's it. And then we hightail it over here, and the door should now be open. Yes, it is. Get a little bit of frame rate lag there. Okay, obviously a lot of enemies. Let's fix that, shall we? Goodness. No need to be so aggressive. Come on, come on. Oh. I gotta remember, those do not last long against those guys. Got one. Got two. Got three. Got four. I'm good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I have to blur that. <laughs> Bleep that. No, come on. There we go. No! Unnecessary hit. Unnecessary violence on the part of the enemy. Ooh, they almost got me on that one. Alright, that should buy me some time there. Let's get some more shields out. It's V4 now. I love the idea of upgrading it even more. Uh... Oh yeah, I should have been wearing this the whole time. Oh, what was I thinking? What was I thinking? It might find somebody. Yeah, it did. There we go. Yes. We love experience here at Ratchet and Clank. Note to self, always wear the holo charger, shield charger. Oh, I'm sensing 
Good things in my future in this next room. Yes! Continue point! That is what I am talking about. That is what I needed in my life. Oh, we're too late. Time to time to clutch up. Get in. How long have we been going? 30 minutes. Okay, we got just enough time for whatever the heck this is. I hope. I think. Maybe? I'll figure it out. I'm having a lot of fun playing this. I hope you're having a lot of fun watching it, because, man... There it is! Nefarious has already initiated the launch sequence! This is my childhood right here. If gets into space, Felden won't have a chance! That's not gonna happen. There is no way we are going to let that happen. It's time... ...to be a hero. Get to the chopper! Don't! Oh. Okay, gonna start this fight off a little bit handy handicapped. Okay, gotta pop my back. Again? You will pay for your insolence, you miserable rodent. I'm actually very happy, not miserable at all. Sorry, nefarious. Your flight's been canceled. Ah, Lawrence. 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 Now, what weapon should I use against him? Maybe of assistance? Annihilate him! Just kidding. You've reached my holographic voicemail. Leave your name and a brief message. Ta-ta! And a brief message. Fine. I'll do it myself. Okay, uh, get a couple of these out there. And then... Uh, let's hit him with this. Ooh. Oh, good on you. Oh, blast. Oh, blast it. No, I am completely mistiming that. I, I'm having trouble seeing him. I think he's going to get me this first time. I have to go ham on him. Oh no! There was health right there. I'm looking right at it. Mm. Okay, this is good. This is good. I like a good challenge. You got to get quick scope, my guy. Oh. Rose got a lot of HP. He's tough. Can I just stay further out from those? Oh man, those are so hard to see coming. Jeez, I didn't put it on the harder difficulty setting. I cannot take this guy lightly. Okay. It would certainly help if I was better at avoiding his attacks. There we go. I am defeated. We know that's not I the have end. No choice but to throw myself on your mercy. Really? Uh, I mean, that's right, Nefarious. <laughs> your reign of terror is finally sucker. Love him or hate him, that man's got style. Oh, you're a villain, all right, just not a super one. Oh yeah, what's the difference? Presentation. And you might hate to, oh no. I didn't know there was an edge. Oh, <laughs> no. Of course there's an edge. Okay, okay. Ooh, yeah, blast it. Alright. Yup. 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 Okay. And this guy. Uh, 
Oh no, oh no. There's a challenge mode if I ever did see one. I want that nanotech, honestly. I'm gonna need it. Oh god. Oh, I. Dang! Bro, that's too fast! Why did that happen so fast? Oh my god. Okay. Okay, we can I skip it? There we go. Okay, this time don't go flying off the edge. This time don't go flying off the edge. Get some ammo here. Yeah, I knew it wasn't the well, obviously I knew it wasn't the end because I've played the game before, but even someone who hadn't played the game before might think it's a wee bit suspicious that the man still got over two thirds of his health bar. I know I could use the PDA, but I'm trying to save money here. Now, I can't remember how intense does this next part get? <laughs> That's never a good sign. Ooh! Bro! Bro, stop! Thank goodness, oh gosh. Because I remember, I think, uh, I think I used to run at this part. Like, I, I think I used to literally just book it and not look back at all. Uh, I'm just going to turret all the way there. And collect nanotech along the way. Take cover! Oh gosh. Is this a good cover? Bro, I don't know when he stops. When does he stop, bro? What? Stop, 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 stop. Oh my gosh. Got full HP, though. Uh, okay. Do I have to shoot him to make him stop? No! Sadness! Gotta go for the nanotech. Is that a safe haven? Jesus, man. I gotta run past him. Hang on, let me get the uh, shield charger back on. Can I level these up by just throwing them in his way? Run! Dun dun da 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 dun dun dun. You don't stand a chance against my superior piloting skills. I cheesed it. Oh. Okay, okay. No, no! No! Oh, God, there's no continuation. It's just... Oh. Hello, hello. Mic check, mic check. We still good? Alrighty, then. I thought I crashed it. So, I can run past all of the enemies. Or I can... I'm, I'm going to try to legitimately fight them. But man, that was... It's tough. Uh, let's just try something that needs upgrading, I guess. Okay, bouncer. Uh, and then definitely want to get our shield charger on, because holy crud. Dude, what? The bouncer took him out that quickly? It's like... There's no way, because the bouncer didn't deal that much damage to most other enemies. Come on, come on. There we go, shields. Okay. Um, I just... It's almost as if the bouncer... Oh, whoa, whoa! Okay, maybe it is really powerful. Yeah, it's super powerful. 
Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Help, frame rate, frame, frame rate, help. I might not be able to complete this. Hang on, I gotta I gotta draw back for a bit here. Can I can I save? Will that help? I better do it on a separate save in case it's corrupted. Okay, let's get a couple of shields out there. See, that's the one thing that annoys me, is like... Uh, there we go. Okay, he does fly off. Okay, he flies off for a bit there. Yes! Bouncer level 2. Excuse me, Bouncer V2. This is actually really important, because apparently this weapon is incredibly powerful. Which makes me want to level it up even more. And I definitely want stage 5 on this bad boy. Okay, let's look around. Ammo, nanotech, that whole business. Uh, there's some na nanotech, but there's what we need. Look at all those Gadgetron boxes. And there's our shield glove! In addition to damage absorption and health drain, the Ultra Shield fires a trio of destructive energy pulses at nearby enemies each time it takes a hit. Well, heck, I love the idea of that. Put some more of that on my plate. Hold on, just tap. There we go. Nighty night. Put some more of that on my plate, please and thank you. You take that. Excellent. Okay, I was going to allow myself to take one hit, since there is quite a bit of nanotech around. Come on, throw out the other one. Okay. Now launch that bad boy. <laughs> oh, yes! I love it. Okay, so you can take out the enemies. It's not really that bad, though. Uh-oh. There we go. Okay, now there's more that's gonna pop up. There we go. Okay, let's get some shields out there. And a one, and a two, and a skiddly diddly do. Oh yeah, the rangers come and help. Yes, there we go. Bro, look at me with 100% HP. Oh, stop that. Yeah, get them, rangers. Nice. That might be the way you're supposed to do it. That way you have some backup support. Because when I ran in there, I had nobody to assist. Okay. Uh, definitely going to go with this guy. Uh, we got six left on him. Yep. The Farious ain't going to be easy, though. Oh, I missed time that one. Okay, we want to keep shields up and out, and then our agents of doom. If any of those go, uh, if any of those are not being used, then I'm doing something wrong. All right, then switch to the bouncer. Now that the bouncer is up, uh, it can't be used multiple times. It's going to take a second to cool down. Okay, let's get a couple of shields out. Alright, he's got missiles coming in. We're ready with the bouncer. Land! Land there, big fella! Go ahead and land, I dare you! That's what I thought. Alright, we're out of bouncer ammo, and I think he hit me with that one. Oh, that's right, the shield charger! Alright, let's see what now, uh, right, right, what the, I meant to switch to the shield charger because it says it, every time it takes a hit, 
it does electricity. Ooh. All right, let's get some more boys out there. Ages of Dread. All right, that's the last of them. And hit him with the disc gun. Oh, blast. He went up right in the nick of time. Is there any ammo around that I can get for my... That's the Ultra Shield Launcher. Okay. Ooh, that one got me. Watch it. Land. Land, curse you. Oh. He's got me where I can't stop moving. Oh, that's what the problem is. Oh, nope. Quick select only. Oh, God. Don't fumble it at the last second. I wanted my shield charger. And now, this guy. Hold and fire away. All right, out of ammo on that bad boy. Get something else out here. One. Two. That is not what I was looking for. One. Two. Three. And four. That's the last of them. Do I have any more? Nope. Whew, this guy is tough. Pardon me. Oh, we're going to take some damage here. I'm genuinely hoping that this can reach him even while he's in the air. Because I don't know any other way to stop him from firing. Oh, only one left. Zero, 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 okay. Zero, hmm. How about... Definitely want to get my shield charger back on. Oh no, it just went out. Shield charger. Good God. And then... I gotta find the real one. He's right there. Come on now. Woo! Okay. Hope that works. That got a hit. Uh... No, that is the that is the worst possible scenario. Uh, we might be in for it here, folks. Man. Do I have anything left that can hit him? I might have to hit up the PDA, folks. Yes! Woo! That's a tough one. It's important, sir. It's almost time for my solo. Begin the transformation! I call it Base Odyssey. Now, Lawrence! Oh, if you insist. That was a lot tougher than I remember it being back in the day, but then again, this whole game has been, has been so... I'm really happy with that. And here comes Captain Quark to save the day. this fight at all, so... Hey, can I fire anything else? Is there... Can I go up? Okay, I can go down and up. 
I heard you're supposed to do a figure eight pattern. Okay, figure eight, figure eight. Oh god. See, that's what I'm worried about. Dang, I'm taking hits every time, bro. We're getting him, but it ain't looking too good. Yep, that's looking bad. Let's get him a little bit closer, but not too close. I think we got this. Figure eights. Yeah, boy. That's the easy part. Would you care to specify a destination, sir? Who cares? Just get us out of here. What? That wasn't even close to 60 seconds! <laughs> we are live from the I finally did it. Of the latest Hollow Film I beat Ratchet and Clank series. up your arsenal for YouTube on the Let's Play. Because obviously I've done it. <laughs> I did it when I was a kid several times. I guess I was a young teenager by that point, though. They came out back-to-back -back three years in a row. Which, again, is an amazing feat for any development company. Of anything, really. Let alone video games. I mean, I, I heard the team worked really hard. Uh, there's a great video by the Golden Bolt that explains way more about this series than I ever could. So I'll probably uh, either link that in the description below, or just add it straight to the playlist. Because it's just... He's amazing at like figuring out all the stuff about Ratchet and Clank in general that I had no idea even existed. And I played this game for years. All of them. Well, up to deadlocked. <laughs> the time has come to say goodbye. <laughs> Your tricks won't do you any good this time, Agent Clank. I have been waiting for this moment a long time, and now I am going to blow you into a million pieces! <laughs> Get this thing off me! Got him. I know I don't usually... He got that monkey off his back. <laughs> Didn't want to ruin the corniest joke of the series. But, um... Yeah, I, I usually don't talk through the cutscenes, but not even think about it. I couldn't help it. I'm just, I'm really happy that I actually beat it. Roll credits. Yes! That is the best. Well, I'm, I'm happy that, I'm happy that's happening. Um, I think the next video I should be working on is obviously the one right before this. This one, which will be the conclusion, and then I've got uh, another Dub Squad victory montage to get to we have three wins so let's see that's not gonna be too hard to edit I'll probably start working on that tomorrow I think that's like number six and like almost all of them have multiple wins in the same stream it's crazy man we're doing great uh, dub squads just killing it man we're doing amazing uh, check us out on Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 I mean we are uh, shout out to Mike DeShuta, Swag, uh, Loaf, aka Slime. Um, gosh, who else? There's so many. Uh, Infinite Phoenix, if you're watching this, you're doing awesome. Uh, gosh, uh, uh, GD Jaw TV. Uh, let's see. Uh, da -da -da. I'm going to forget several. I know I'm going to forget several. Uh, gosh. I should, you know, a list. A list would be good. Why not have a list? I, I should make a list. But yeah, this has been an amazing series. I'm so glad to have played it. The next in the series lineup is going to be Ratchet Deadlocked, um, which just features... Uh, and again, I know this is a 20... 21-year-old game now? Something around that line. Um, this is an old game. But see, the people that are watching this may not have ever seen it before because, you know, the younger audience is like, Ratchet and Clank? The heck is that? Um... Ironically, what you think gaming was 20 years ago, like Mario 64, or 
or Super Mario Bros. That wasn't gaming 20 years ago. That was gaming 30 years ago. This is gaming 20 years ago. It's crazy how time flies and just gets, um, it just goes right by you. But as long as you're enjoying that time, it's not time wasted. And that's always important to remember. As I was saying, I really love this series. I've loved Ratchet and Clank, at least up to Up Your Arsenal, for as long as I can remember. I've played each one through in New Game Plus at least four or five times each. Uh, I had, like, honestly, before I started on Oblivion, uh, like the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion, this was my jam. You could not get me off of these games. It was this, RuneScape, or Guild Wars 1. All of that before I, uh, and then, and then when, uh, when the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion came out, I just, I, I start, I just doubled down. I had a, between three different characters, I had a thousand, almost two hours, almost two thousand hours in that game. I could have submitted it for, uh, for, uh, I could have submitted it for, uh, community service. I could have submitted it for community service. I had so much time in those games um which you know it, <laughs> you know it doesn't sound like something you want to brag about but you know i i stayed in sh in shape you know i didn't just pull a cartman <laughs> um but uh i'll have to reference that as well um never did get into world of warcraft probably could have but i digress uh the next series, the next uh, game in the series, Ratchet and Clank Deadlocked. I'm going to be enjoying playing that for you. Um, I'm not sure about the future trilogy. I believe it is Future Tools of Destruction. Um, and then a future crack in time? I'm not sure what order they come in. Because around the time that the Ratchet and Clank game started coming out for the PlayStation 3... Me and my mom were going through some really, really tough times financially, and I just wasn't buying any new games at all back then. I had Elder Scrolls Oblivion, and that was it. It was, uh, it was get up, go to work for Mr. Clean Cleaning's uh, company, uh, clean hotel rooms, make seasonal cash, make like $50, $60 a day between the two of us if we're lucky. Uh, like, it was rough. Me and my mom having to get a job together and like barely being able to pay, uh, play, uh, pay bills, it do hit different when you stutter so much. Uh, but yeah, we were going through a really tough time financially because the house was due and we weren't getting it paid off. And I got a lot of a, a lot of great stories that led me to this life. Um, but you know, pressure uh, pressure forms diamonds, or it can break you. And I'm still here. I'm still kicking. And I hope you're doing alright out there too. Um, yeah, I never got to play the Ratchet & Clank Future Series. And there's a lot of games I didn't get to play around that time. But, you know, tomorrow's another day. Anyway, uh, I was hoping I would think of enough to say while the credits rolled so we could see the end of it. Because I'm almost certain that there is a um, an end. There's like a... An end cinematic. I'm sure there's an end ending cinematic. I mean, I've never run out of things to say. I could ramble on forever. What's the next thing I want to talk about? Oh, speech compression and decompression technology are licensed from dialogue recording and additional cinematic sound production provided by USB headset audio driver provided by oh, Logitech. Hey, that's a hot household name nowadays. Ratchet and Clank up your arsenal. I can't read it that fast. We would like to thank each individual with Sony Computer Entertainment America for their contribution, support, and dedication to the success of Ratchet and Clank up your arsenal. <laughs> oh, man. I'm going to have to pause those and read them because I haven't read them in, like, again, 20 years. Um, another thing that I'd like to, I sometimes think about doing is doing enough of the collectibles or uh, finding out how to access the Insomniac Studios in these games. Because I'm not certain how many Insomniac Studios I actually had unlocked as a kid. I remember one of them was accessible from a teleportation pad at 3 in the morning. Again, I love rambling. I'm serious. 3 in the morning. And there were two ways to do it. 
You can either go to that location in the real 3 a.m. your time, or you could do what most people did. What do you mean we can't teleport to a planet? I'm afraid we're well out of range, sir. Perhaps if you had bothered to specify a destination. When will we be in range? Oh, I'm sure something will come along in, in say, say, five or ten thousand years. Ah, I don't believe this. I knew it. I knew there was an ending cutscene. <laughs> I don't suppose you can play drums. <laughs> so it would have been great if it was just Laura. Oh, Janus. Like he freaking uh glitched out again but um what was the thing i was saying ah yes or back in the day there was old there was an old uh is it really a tip or a trick or a glitch or a bug it's not really there was a there was a workaround you could do you could set your own playstation 2's internal clock to like 255 wait five minutes and then just go right in which is what most people did and i think i i don't think i did it the first time i definitely did it the second time and I don't know which game that was for. Was it for Going Commando? Was it for this game up your arsenal? Or did Ratchet and Clank 1 actually have an Insomniac Studios 2? I bet you it did. It must have. Because I had the whole Ratchet and Clank booklet. If you watch my Ratchet and Clank Let's Play series on that, I bring up the booklet like a goober a couple of times during the series. And there's no way without the internet that I ever could have figured out how to do that. I mean internet existed but I didn't have a personal computer at the time but there's no way without a personal computer I ever would have figured that out without the booklet so that must have been how I that must have been how I did it and I had all the gold bolts I had I had all the achievements I had everything anyway congratulations Ratchet on defeating Dr. Nefarious at this point you and time warp back to just before you finish the game with square or you can enter challenge mode with circle in challenge mode you start a new game against tougher enemies but all your experience weapons armor and money from the current game uh carry over there are other surprises as well i'm gonna teleport to just before i defeated dr nefarious actually should i because i don't want to have to i mean i don't mind doing it again I want to teleport to before I defeated Dr. Nefarious because the next thing I want to do with this is the um, the Quark battle mode. Uh, so yeah, let's time warp. Let's do the time warp again. And now the video is copyright protected. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I want to do the Quark challenge mode on a live stream. I guess I'll do it in the morning. Now what would be really awesome is if you could... You can just go straight to the battle with Quark. That's awesome. That's awesome. You don't even have to defeat Dr. Nefarious again, my guys. You could just go straight to the Bio Obliterator, and we know how much of a pushover that was. So yes, challenge mode is coming up next. We're going to head it off to Annihilation Nation, and the next time you see me will be during a live stream for the Quarktastic Challenge. <clears throat> the Quarktastic Challenge. Uh... Annihilation Nation? Anyone? There we go. I think there was only that one challenge I had left. I'm also kind of wondering whether or not I should just do it as a... Like, if I should just record it straight and then do it as a preview. Like, have it up as a... What do you call it? I can't remember what it's called. Quarktastic Battle. It's worth... Is that 200,000? I think that's 200,000. That's not bad. But it is 99 rounds of enemies. So, I want to be ready. Which is another reason, the major reason, why I wanted the PDA. Because a couple of times I tried the Quarkastic battle, and I ran out of ammo. But anyway, that's all the time I have left for this episode and more. I hope you enjoyed it. There'll be more of this series, or at least Ratchet & Clank, deadlocked or Ratchet Deadlocked in the future. Again, hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comment section below. It really helps the channel. Likes are always appreciated. And until next time, remember to sit back, relax, and take it easy, my friends.